Hello there, this is KDJ Zone and I'm back with another game of Age of Empires and uh, this is special guys, this is one of a kind and this is quite an old game actually and uh, it's between Bope underscore XR and uh, AR Shokunu and uh, you guys must have seen Tower Rushes, you guys must have seen Douche but this is special, this is a Tower Rush and a Douche in one game, I don't even know what that's called but it's it's fun, it's nice, and I hope you guys enjoy this one. Let me introduce the players to you. This is Aaron Deskachokanu playing with Hans, and uh, there you go, that's his map. He's got a goal very close to his town center, which is very good. His forage bush is a bit crappy, but that is still okay. He has his villages close to his forage bush, the ones that are cutting wood, so that is pretty decent. And he does obviously have a wallable map, it's pretty open over here. He has got a bad hill over there, so that is also not very good. But that is his map guys and let's go to his opponent who the one who's gonna do all the stuff in this game because he's the Persians and he has got that ability that 4800 hit points on that town center which makes him capable of doing the douche. Yes, doing the douche he's going to do it and he's going to double it up with the tower rush and it's going to be fun and that's his map guys and uh, he's got his gold also quite far forward which is not very good. Uh, that's his second goal actually, I really don't know, he's got his wood cutters very far away, you can see 5 on wood right now and the rest are on food, so that is a little different from the standard stuff and uh, is he gonna send his villages now 7 minutes 52, minutes 52 seconds into game time and he's waiting to go to feudal age is it? I'm gonna go to his point of view and see what it is, yes he's clicking feudal age and he's sending his villages forward, you see that's the army of villages 4 plus five nine villages forward this guy this guy finds that out actually air joker knows about it so how does he react to it how do you react to a douche what do you do he's sending his villages forward to do some stuff over here does he build some houses over there no he's building palisade walls that is not good enough his palisade walls are pretty far away i don't know whether he has been douched before but that palisade wall is quite far away that is not good it, a town center can be built over here it can be built over there or maybe even here so that's not that's not good enough and the villages are anyways going to come in and it's gonna make town center. I think it's gonna make it over there. There you go. There you go. Town center is gonna come up, and he is in trouble already. There you see trouble in paradise. He's gonna send his villages away because this town center is gone. I'm gonna look at his resources and see if he can make another town center. He actually can. He actually can make another town center if you if he deletes this one he should have done that he's not doing that he's trying to counter that with the tower and that is absolutely nonsense that is not gonna work out and uh, that is good stuff once you do this do she really wonder what to do after that but this is good stuff he's carrying on his good work he's doing a tower over there so this is stuff that people don't do generally so this is a good tutorial for all those guys for doing a douche against an opponent and I don't know how good this player is I don't even know the ear of this guy but this is a good strategy actually a douche and a tower rush in the same game so obviously he's doing his stone mining duties at home he has three villages on stone so that is pretty decent and he's putting up his second tower he's sending his villages forward to bring the tower down but there are way too many villages over here he's sending all his villages forward to get the tower down but the tower might actually come up so that is not good enough for him i really don't know why he's keeping that town center alive you can't delete the town center and to do it somewhere else he's getting his scouts out that is not good stuff actually this this town center is going to get that town center down surely eventually it has to get it down so probably he's going to lose that watchtower but that town watchtower is up and is doing a lot of damage right now and I'll see the number of kills and deaths right now one kill and four deaths so four guys have died over here and uh, here Chukunu I really don't know why he's so adamant and he's keeping that town center over there so there you go the two towers I was talking about he's missing a wall over there he's doing a third tower somewhere is that the tower no that's not a tower he's completely passive wall his opponent so he's been a douche in this game an absolute douche and he's doing a good good job over here he's got so many villages forward mind you idle time on all those villages so obviously he needs to do his stuff and he's going to break get that stone wall down and come inside and do some more damage he can actually walk all the way and come over there but that is not a good idea so it's good to get this uh, stone wall down but there's one more stone wall behind it so that is good stuff from uh, from the blue player and uh, let's see what he's doing he's all, got all his villages over here so that is good stuff he's going to do his stone mining himself uh, to defend against uh, the yellow player and there you go the yellow player actually walks down through this town center to this area and he's going to start his tower rushing duties on this side of the map 
So this is really bad stuff for this guy and he should have not repaired this town center. I'm sure, I'm sure he's never been douched before. So that is not good guys and uh, you just should delete your town center and do a town center maybe quite far away actually that is a good strategy but there you go he is trying to do a watchtower over there before this watchtower comes up but eventually this watchtower is going to come up there you go that's a good timing uh, to get the defensive watchtower up uh, but he's getting attacked by villagers so that's not good he's going to try to get those villagers down but he's going to lose his villagers too so he has to be very careful there you go he's lost some villagers he's lost already 10 villagers right now so that is not good stuff he's got some scouts down also so probably less than 10 villages and uh, there you go that's the one scout i was talking about so he still keeps his town center alive he's producing villages from the town center so that is pretty, still very good and he's repairing that town center so that is not a good thing to do and he's out of stone right now he's almost out of stone so i don't think he can do any more defensive uh, watch towers so that is not good news by the way as you see, can't repair out of resources, no wood, no stone left and uh, he is doomed right now. That's the problem, you can't keep on repairing the town center. The time he had, all the time in the world to make another town center, he had all the resources in the world to, to make another town center. He didn't do that, so it's really, really stupid over here and uh, there you go. He keeps on repairing the town center, obviously now he can't, he has to keep that town center alive and produce villages from there, so, so that is not good stuff from the... the purple player i'm sorry the blue player and uh, let's look at how many how many villages he has right now uh pop is 21 so that is not good the 30 pop yellow player is surely going to win this game so there she go tower rush and a douche in the same game and meanwhile he's doing his farming over there so how cool is that that is really cool and there you go the town center has gone down he's going to get that watchtower down and what is this guy going to do he can't do anything he's going to resign and he is going to lose this game so that was crazy guys that was absolutely crazy and apologies for uh, not having any sound and uh, well i don't know whether you heard the lightning and a thunder but that is happening outside but in this game the in-game sound is disabled for this uh, recording and the reason for that is there's some problem with the sound is very very high i'm not able to do some justice to it and i have to find out i have to tune the settings but so that is that guys this is the game and this is a douche and the tower rush at the same time hope you guys enjoyed that game and uh, i'll be back with more more stuff in future so take care and bye bye